now we are discussing about the vocational subject in group 3 elective section b which is robotics and artificial intelligence whose paper code is 66 now this paper is being held tomorrow so we will discuss the strategy to score well in this paper and i, I will also solve the mcqs and given in the specimen paper of it let us know so um, class 10 the theory is of 100 marks and there is only one written paper and 100 marks is for the practical examination it is same as the ICC computer applications paper the pattern of uh, marking 100 marks for project and 100 marks for the written examination so let us so here it is written key concepts of class 9th need to be revised as the pre-request so you have to revise class 9th because the concepts are interconnected and here it is explicitly mentioned that you have to revise it new age robotic system now this is uh, more about theory parts and now this is simple theory um, from robots to cobots so this is also a theoretical part not a very uh, application part so now this part components of robots as a system now this is also a, some theory parts and though this these parts are not that tough they are theoretical only because only some types of theories are given not in in-depth uh, discussion of any theory because obviously your class is 10 control of robotic systems example of control system from daily life this part is also not that tough now this is included input controller robot, ro robot feedback this part is also included integrating sensor actuators controller in robotic system illustration by a simple example now we will just go to the coding part visualization design and creation of components the robotic part is uh, more about more about theoretical and very simple um, the question may be application based but the mostly part is theoretical artificial intelligence the, the second part now this is also class 9th concepts are required so the decision the making this is an important part and this is a conceptual part um, yes I agree that, that uh, it has story but this is a very much conceptual part um, as compared to the robotics part decision making is very very important machine learning obviously um, this has great future even today if you are uh, developing concepts in such an early age such in class 10 you will be surely benefited from it machine learning and cyber security in computing yes uh, the the Turing test the famous test of, mach of machine intelligence so cyber security a basic understanding of security um, and forgive me for my pronunciation if my pronunciation is not as good as you expected I am extremely sorry for it components of AI project framework problem scoping data acquisition now these are very important parts for, in the, for, in the point, for the point of view of examination data exploration modeling and evaluation now this, uh, these parts are not in much detail but they are equally important so you have to study all of them because this paper has been recently added so I cannot predict which part will have more weightage Introduction. Now this is the application part where you will be learning Python programming language. Now this is the basic of Python, NumPy, Pandas, Sci-Fi, uh, mat, Matplotlib implementation using simple programs in Python. As you know, Python is very essential for data handling, data analysis, and data science. Science also. Python is very much essential. So you will be learning the basics of Python programming now. Lists and tuples in Python. Um, now the uh, extended sort search is also there strings the string function is also common with java so for icsc computer application which is a different subject i think in a different group i think section a of third elective now you will be doing java here and this is a skill based paper vocational paper uh, actually means the skill based paper, practical paper so you will be doing programming of python here so python if you consider about the you know, uh, data science and artificial intelligence python is more valuable than java Java is uh, for mostly for applet uh, you know, process, uh, applet uh, application, uh, websites and other things. But uh, Python for data analysis and data science is much more essential compared to Java. So per here you will be learning string functions, almost all, almost inbuilt function you will be learning. So this is the overview of syllabus. Now we will solve the MCQs given in the specimen paper and also we will analyze the specimen paper that what they are asking and in, in what way they are asking. Now this paper is of 2 hours where you will be additionally given 15 minutes for only for the reading time. Let us see this paper in detail. Section A which is MCQ and you select the field in which the following robots are used. So it is a warehouse obviously a warehouse this option is only correct the second option 
which of the following is an example of probabilistic company probabilistic computing now this i think weather forecast this is a easy question not very tough uh, uh, about the mcqs that are given in the specimen paper which of the following statements about the cobots um, is true um cobots uh, work uh, collaboratively with humans now this is true um think tinker cat tinker cat can be used to design and stimulate the motion of a simple robotic system such as wheeled mobile robot now this is true or false now obviously this statement is true fifth consider the following block diagram of a control system and robot input controller robot feedback which component of this system is responsible for making decision based on sensor data now if you are talking about sensor data the controller will only uh, do it sixth is what is the function of actuators in a robotic system actuators now they convert the electrical signal into physical movement option c would be the uh, answer um the seventh is which of the following characters used to give a single line comment single line comment is uh, given by hashtag in python programming language camera is an example of uh, um now we are uh, camera is obviously a vision sensor uh, which of the following expression is the correct option for ab now this is very easy question very easy now if you are talking about uh, um let us uh, supposedly the option is obviously b a multiplied multiplied b Following is a uh, correct option of A. We know it. I don't think it is correct. I think it would be. Um, I assume it to be a exponential of A. B. No, the correct answer is uh, A, not B. I'm actually sorry. So about the tenth question. Now here it is that which statement about single board computers in robotics is correct? Um, I thought it was power supply. B is not correct. Um, single board computers are not suitable for the use of these models. Single board computers are used to control the operations of a robotic system. C is correct. Um, eleventh, in the context of machine learning, what is the role of data? Now, the to provide uh, examples for prediction of machine learning and prediction. Now, yes, B is correct. Twelfth, the motor is a robot works as a slash n. The twelfth one is actuator. Actuator is the option. Which statement is best describe the the Turing test? So the Turing test uh, is best described by um, I think uh, here it is uh, evaluates machine inter it evaluates machines intelligent. The fourteenth, what is the primary goal of cyber security? Cyber security the protect the data from unauthorized access. This is a very simple question. B is the option. Yes. As such, the, the the Turing test helps in evaluating the intelligence of machine. The Turing test um, checks if the machine can exhibit human-like behavior. Now there are assertion as well as reason. Um, I think uh, yes, both are true. And R is the correct explanation of A. A option would be there. And now the next question: What are the four W's used for understanding a problem in AI project scoping? Now here it is a theory-based question. Which is option C? Who, what, where, why? If any option is incorrect by me by mistake, then you will uh, obviously comment it down. I will acknowledge it. Now this uh, question: What type of graph is shown in this image? Now this is uh, obviously um, supposed to be pie chart. Obviously pie chart. It's a pie chart. Now the next question: <coughs> Testing and print testing one point one is two one is two five. Sorry, not one point five. One is two five. What would be printed now? This uh, string would be, I think, uh, here is uh, um, this. This would be printed because space is also included. Um, the full form of IDLE. Now the IDLE is obviously B. This is a theory-based question. Which operation can be performed on the on both list and tuples? This is also theory question. Access elements can be performed both on the list and the tuples. So about the list paper, there is a more theory based paper. If you want, I will solve the section B programming paper. Uh, you can comment down your doubts because you are having examination tomorrow only. You can comment down if you want. I will solve the uh, programming paper. Okay, thank you. Best of luck for your exa examination.